Okay. Good luck. And then let's try this Zen mode thing. Oh yeah, I took a corner. Look, I countered all that territory he took. Oh, that's a fun little strategy. Um, I'll take a corner. Let's see, is this showing up at all? Eh, it looks okay. That looks quite okay. Okay. Um, you know, I'll take a corner. Alright. Um. Yeah, let's be predictable. I'll take a corner. Alright, so the largest area of the board. Um, is the outside. <laughs> what do I do now that I've taken all four corners? I, I connect four and I win, right? That's how it works. Alright, so... This looks like a pretty big side. Let's take that. This... I'll take the bottom as well. Okay, so he wants that corner. Uh, we'll make some attempt to contest it. Um... I should just play Tengen, guys. Alright. Oh, uh, that's actually too close. Let's... Pick over here somewhere. Okay. Um... Yeah, this is the most confusing BS ever. Just saying. Um. Okay. I can't see the timer in Zen mode, though. Okay, so I'm down 8 minutes to 9 minutes or something. Like, the only thing I'd like added to this would be some kind of timer display somewhere. Because I'm not playing a correspondence game, so time is actually kind of sort of relevant. Oh, right, I haven't protected my corners properly. Um, so let's protect this corner. Okay, protect that corner. Um... Well, that's a local situation now, isn't it? Um... Okay. Okay. Uh... Atari? I'm not in Atari, right? So I can afford to do this? And I'm picking up two stones plus the corner. Okay, he wants to fight over there. I don't even know if I want to fight him. Like... This doesn't seem... Okay, there... I mean, there is this opposition right here, but this doesn't seem very urgent. Like, where would I even go if this were urgent? I could throw that stone and still, like, protect other corners and take stuff, and that seems more important than a single stone. I probably shouldn't have put this right here. Um, but I can cut him, so why not? Yeah, it's usually urgent, but I don't see the urgency here. Okay, I'm an Atari. So let's deal with that. An Atari this way, too. Um. Let's 
is confusing. Alright, so... Oh, he Atari's me if I don't extend out. So... Um, but do I ladder him here? What is my opponent smoking? And where can I get some? Okay. Am I correct in reading that that's just... Like he extends and I trap him. So that's done. Uh... Oh, I gave up the corner. Maybe. I got three stones, but I forgot about my corner. Um, yeah, that's not so good then, is it? Alright, I'm an Atari. That resolves the Atari. I'm an Atari again, but... Do I fill? Filling seems like a really slow move. Um... Yeah, we'll fill that. Um, so we don't lose a stone, and I'm threatening to be 18, but I'm not sure I even want to bother doing that. Oh, uh, this is a ranked game, so I'm not, um, asking for kibitzing. At least not before I screw up. <laughs> Gotta make our own mistakes, guys. No, oh, that's okay. I, I, as long as I've already goofed up, it's okay to call me out on it. But, but yeah, I guess proactively, like, uh, I don't know. Maybe I should play unranked so people can freely kibitz. I'm sure OGS has some policy about um, kibitzers. Yeah, Black's opening was super weird. I've got him thinking, though. So there's that going for me. I wonder if my group in the upper left is doomed. I mean, it would take a lot of time for him to capture it, and I could take a lot of territory in that time. Um, I want another eye somewhere around here. Let's build up some influence this way. So that even if somehow I lose all this and end up losing the upper left corner, at least I got the left side. Um, I know it's an empty triangle, though, but, um, I just keep seeing opportunities to kill things. So I might lose my empty triangle, but, um, if not, this turns out well for me. If I do lose it, even that's not the end of the world. Right, so I got two liberties. He's got three. So I'm not winning a capture race. <laughs> because two is less than three, unfortunately. Wait, if I go B13, he goes B12, I go A12. Um, I'm still alive. In fact, if I could just go B12 directly, 
No, then he Atari's me. So let's try to live this. I'm gonna learn here. Oh. Um. So I'm thinking like a twelve, and I'm okay. Not sure if that's right. Like, anytime I make a statement, I'm almost certain I'm wrong. Um, yeah, 19Q here, so... Um, I might have just lost a stone for no reason. Which would be sad. Uh, if I go here... He Atari's me, and I don't have anywhere to go. Well, I could kill this. Wait, if I go C12... Um, it's Atari, so... Oh, he resigns. Okay, let's see if he says anything. Uh, he's not saying anything. Whatever. So, if I go C12... That's Atari... He connects. Sorry that I'm just exhausted already. Ah, uh, yeah, I think that's probably it. He's just bored. Um, so he's ranked 22Q. I'm 20Q. Um, if he wanted fast, he could have clicked, hit the blitz button instead of the live button. They would have got a much faster game. But, yeah, point taken. Maybe that's what he wanted. Wait, so if I go uh, C12, if he connects, um, I'm not even sure that that's the best move, but if he connects, I could go B11, atari this, and then if he tries to kill me, I kill the stone first and I get out. Um... But, where's the analyze, analyze button? So, like, obviously if this, I just escape. Um, but what if... What if we go this way? Um... And then what? <laughs> I don't understand how you get to 22Q um, and complaining about how other people are moving too slowly. Like, A14. Is, okay, yeah, it did occur to me. So that's Atari. So I have to connect, and then something. Uh, I think I'm okay. Yeah, I think I survived that too. Oh. Okay, some people start there. Okay. C10. You're suggesting continuing with C10 here. Like. I don't understand. Oh, okay, maybe this group over here does live and Black is getting out. I just counted these four as dead, but this might actually save those four. Granted, I could start building up stones everywhere, but yeah, this whole filled shape is pretty ugly. C10, there's B11. Oh, right, it's too weak. Right, so this doesn't escape, these don't escape, um, so C10 right away doesn't work. 
Yeah, Black might need to himself play something less aggressive. And live really pathetically on the edge of the board. Although even here he's probably... I don't know, maybe he's dead. I mean, yeah, we should play a real game. Although, we are practicing reading here, but... Um... <laughs> What a mess. What a mess. Yeah. A move 64 or something. Um, somewhere around here. So if I connect, then C10 here. Uh, yeah. Looks sensible, but... Anyway... It's pretty clear this this is not your typical game of Go. What if 7 in B11? Oh, this here? I mean, I think what I'm concluding, even without 7, even without 7, I think I'm concluding that white is kind of sort of alive here. Even if black does manage to kill this, white's going to have some time to put some stones somewhere and take some territory. But I think white is alive. Unless white chooses to give up these stones for some something else. Um, Yeah, I think I should play another game. Is that okay? Or are we still attached to this game at the moment? Basically, once I'm concluding that White's alive, and that this group here is dead, and that White's kind of got this corner, and White has this corner, and White has this corner, and this side, and this side, and... Like... At some point, I stop reading here, because, um... I don't know. Go is fun. Yeah, let's do a new game. Sorry to those still attached to that game. We're playing a new one. Alright, I will cut the background music, though. So, now we can just talk directly. Alright. Say hi. Good luck. There we go. 4-4. Uh, four, four. Zen mode. Alright, let's pick another 4-4. Four, four. Okay. Um, <laughs> what's the largest side of the board at the moment? I'm going to say down here. pretty large. Okay. And I think I'll say that this corner is kind of big. Okay. Um, shoot, where do I play here? Yeah, let's Let's be a little aggressive, shall we? Okay. Um, so do... I don't want to build toward that. Hmm. So, what to do? This does seem pretty urgent. So I'm going to protect that. Okay. Um, 
And I don't know. Pick somewhere else that's big on the board. Unless this is still urgent. Hmm. Oh, let's pick somewhere else. Let's pick there. That seems fun. Okay. Am I walking into something? I mean, it looks like he's got the left side. And I've got stuff. But I don't know what. Okay. Let the games begin. Or something's happening there. What it is ain't exactly clear. There's a man with a stone over there telling me he's going to put me in Atari somewhere. Um, which way do I go? Oh, he's forcing me to pick a way. That's not cool. Do I just, like, pick another corner and say, okay, you can have that stone? Because, like, he's not running left and he's not running right. Or do I go this way? I mean, going toward the corner seems silly. Uh, yeah, let's build something this way. Yeah, I do have it spam that every half hour or so. Um, these days, journalism is important, believe it or not. Facts matter. Um, so. I guess I'll take something. Uh, sure, let's take this side of the board. So we've done a thing over here. Um, I'm tempted just to chuck a stone in this vicinity somewhere. I'm not sure where. But that's too close to the center, too early. Oh, do I go this way? To get some fourth line stone somewhere around here. Um, oh. I think it says go. I'm pretty sure I changed that before the stream. Yeah, let's pick this side. He's picking a fight, guys. Well, I've somewhat reduced this. Not really. Okay, so we'll just try to jab into the corner somehow. Okay. Let's see. This just feels weird. Like he's put all his stones... He's bending it all on the left side of the board. Um, hmm. <laughs> Many Tanuki. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, the, today's motto seems to be just Tanuki. Um, I don't know what to do. Let's 
pick a fight with that stone. Okay. He's out for my corner, guys. Uh, I can isolate this stone, but if I keep fighting it, that strengthens it. Uh, what else? Half the board is in limbo, guys. Here, let's fight for the other half. <laughs> Just create as much chaos and tension as possible. All right. Sure. I think I'm doing okay there. It's Atari, so I have to... Well, I don't have to get out of Atari, but it just seems like a good idea. Uh, do I get this for free? Nothing's free and go. Right, let's go there. Try to cut these two stones. Alright, he's pretty solidly connected, in fact. Uh, what to do? I kind of blew that corner pretty badly. Um... That was anything but strategic on my part. Weak groups everywhere. Yeah, they, they say I should be making a base somewhere, and I'm not really regarding that advice very well. So, I've got a jillion weak groups uh, and no base. So naturally I should just cut right here. That's just something I should have done earlier, but now it's not the moment. Um, strengthen that. So it's a slightly less weak group than it was a minute ago. Oh, so slightly. Um... I don't like that. Okay, we'll push through. If he's going to try to force me out of the center, I'm going to push through this way. This seems really... Oh, in fact, I'm putting myself basically in Atari if I go there. So that is as sketchy as it looks. Um, so we'll run this way then. Okay. What kind of attempt to surround is that? Like, if he does surround me, then great for him, but... I'll just build a bridge out to the center. And get the heck out of there. Alright, so if he fills one, I can fill the other. Um, weird. Hmm. So I get this for free if I want it. Like, he, that'd be Atari, so he'd connect. Do I want it? How about later? 
Yeah, I need to have two eyes to live. It's Atari. I think I'm alive. Like if I'm not, it's going to take one heck of a cut to split me up. Like I didn't think he was going to do that. I was pretty sure he wasn't going to do that because he can't connect his stones. Okay. I mean, yeah, that's Atari, but I don't have to connect here. I could just cut there. Um... Oh, right, I'm not yet in Byoyomi. I forgot. Even so, I don't need to kill that stone right away. Um... So yeah, I'll be fine in Byoyomi for a while. What? Atari. Protect. Uh, this just seems super dangerous for white. And if I do nothing, he cuts me, but if I do this, I'm... Hmm... Yeah, this is just dangerous stuff, guys. Oh, that's how he's going to connect it all together. So he's not, like, totally dead. Okay. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, hmm. four, three, two, one. Yeah, we're playing with fire here, guys. He's just going to play A13. So A12 was probably... Yeah, I didn't, I didn't foresee this first line connection. Um, but now if I play A13... Oh, I'm an Atari. That's self-Atari. Don't do that. If I play A13, um, oh, this is super dangerous now, isn't it? Huh. Yeah, I'm going to lose some stones, probably. Okay, that's Atari. That's also Atari. Uh, what a mess. Things is happening. 
Yeah, so he protects against my threat to double cut. Um, funny how good players will see these things before they happen. So... This is not working very well. Ten, nine, eight, seven, We're going to get that for free while we still can. Okay, he does make the connection. So I cut. Oh, snapbacks. Guys, those are a thing and go. I could have killed a B12 before he connected. Okay, I... Oh, I'm Nine, stupid. Eight, I can't count. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah, that's what I get for reading the text in our chat window instead of reading the moves on the board. Well... That's disappointing. Yeah, I, I did see this B12 opportunity. I just figured he'd play C12 and A13 at the same time. Um, which kind of doesn't work in Go. You don't get to play two moves at once. Oh, I'm not connecting. Like, that looks all warm and fuzzy and connected, but it's not. Well, I don't know, maybe it is. Like, if he tries cutting right here, I kill two stones. So he's probably connecting there, and I'm connecting to get out. This is a super jealous game. <laughs> Okay. If I go there... Uh, if he tries to ladder, then I just go here. Uh, I don't even know if I want to go there. I kind of do. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Actually, if he extends down, if he plays down here, I just cut here. So, uh, I don't want to place my stones in harm's way. Very undecided about where to put the next stone. Okay, we're running to freedom, guys. I 
don't understand that at all. Wait, this Atari's two stones. That seems obvious in hindsight. A jealous game. All right, we're going for the surround, guys. It's Odds are like a thousand to one on this, but you know, if it works, it'll be awesome. Maybe I'm too pessimistic. Maybe it's already working. Um, so. So much Aji. <laughs> uh, am I just... What am I missing? What am I missing here? He's got two liberties. One of them's that damn eye in the middle. Okay. That's what I'm missing. Ten, nine, There's his other eye. See, if I play here, he plays there, I go here, he kills me. If I fill my own liberty, it kills me that much faster. Okay, so that's what I'm missing. I now see it. Hooray. <laughs> So we run while attacking. Okay, we have to run a little bit faster now. What? Oh, it's Atari. Okay.
I get the sense that that was not... I could have played, like, a space further out. Or even down here at G4. Um, I don't understand that either. Why this? How does that help him? Am I, like, in danger of losing my big group or something? Trying to split this mess up. Also threatened to like jump underneath this stuff he's got going. Okay, oh yeah, that's right, that was forced. For some reason I thought he, he was just going to play like right here. Um, so I think this constitutes a net. Not the prettiest net in the world, but... Um, if I do this, he's got two liberties. I'm kind of short on liberties also. Well, no, I can run easier than he can. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Oh, oh, I might not be able to run. Uh, <sighs> counting lady distracts me so easily. If he caps me there, I go down. Oh. Well, that's not capping me. Oh, that's Atari. Do I care? Probably. So... Missing again. Where is the Atari? More specifically? Like, usually in this situation, he's got some kind of Atari to save his butt. I'm not seeing his Atari here. So, this kind of makes up for me losing the six over here, doesn't it? Yeah, this... we've been fighting this whole game. Like, every time I start to play something near a corner, he's like, Nope, I'm gonna fight. We'll fight in the shade. Um, so... I don't know how many... Oh, I'm in my last Bioyami, so I better keep moving.
You know what? Screw it. Take my stone. I'm not going to read that. I don't have the time and energy to figure that out. Well, maybe the time. Certainly not the energy. Um... <laughs> yeah, this whole game, we've been ignoring P17 there, haven't we? Oh, this could end badly. Um... Oh, I'm connected out, never mind. So there's only so bad it could get. The worst that could happen is I could forget, like, just completely space out. Um. I don't... Hmm. I think I'm ahead in territory, but I'm not sure. That seems early. Only because I'm not sure if I'm living somewhere in this vicinity. Um, actually, G16 would have been a lot better. Uh, that would have kept me alive for certain. Yeah, figuring out what is necessary is surprisingly not an easy task. Oh, really, now I should be playing P17. Like, if he doesn't do something right, if he doesn't play it himself, I should play that right away in that position. Um, otherwise, just try to reduce the corner. And try not to lose these five. I have to connect it up to my rest of everything. Actually, I should be running. Um, well, even here. Here is fine. Here's probably not ideal, because like, I could play there, too. We're gonna fight. Keep it. Yep. Remember the weak stones. So. 
Yeah, I'm connecting through Q13, whether he likes it or not. Oh, wait, if I do this, he Atari's me. Damn it. I thought I was being clever. I'm not as clever as I think I am. I have to run. Yeah, he gets my stone. Whatever. Life is worth a stone. Can I do something about it? Maybe. I don't know. Um, I'm trying to relax, and that's why I'm playing moves without thinking. On. Yeah, there we go. My mouse wouldn't click. Ladder. Ladder, 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 he says. I'm sure there's a ladder here somewhere. <laughs> um, it's Atari, so we respond to Atari. Looks like some nice territory. Okay. I'm not the only person with weak stones around here. Uh, what do I want out of this? I actually have a choice. No, I don't. Oh no. Oh, I got out of that Atari. Um. Let's connect. All right. Uh, if I go there, Yataris. I build Yataris, so that's not so bright. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. I honestly have no idea where to play. Yeah, I appreciated when I used to have, like, full minute Bioyomi. That was nice. Those were the days.
Yeah, I should do Minute Bioyomi next time. Instead of 30 seconds. Oh, well, that's two eyes. Never mind. Um. Ten, nine. That's a dumb move, but <sighs> this whole time control I'm playing is dumb. Um. I need to slow down. Yeah, 30 seconds is a lot of time if I'm using it. But I'm, I'm using it every move, eventually get exhausted, um, just physically. Ten, nine, eight. That first line move is super slow. I need to find somewhere better to play. Okay. That was a good move. Ten. At least it looks quite good. Oh, I should I could be extending this into the, that space. That could be fun. Yeah, that was a dumb, dumb move. Oh well. I'm not calculating very logically at this point. So, assuming I'm not getting murdered over here, I'm taking this corner. Um, it's just weird to have all my stones in this diamond formation thing.
Atari. Sorry. Yeah, this this is double digit Q at its finest. Or double whatever. Yeah, double digit Q is the correct statement or saying. It's right there. Uh, I'm being dumb. Sorry. We're finally playing for this corner, guys. Apparently. Okay. Yeah, we'll have to look at this once the game has ended and see what glorious, glorious opportunities have been squandered. What am I supposed to do about these first line extensions other than ignore them? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Fine, if he can play a first line move, so can I. I just, I have no idea what to do against first line extension. It seems like the slowest possible extension ever. It does eat up space, but I, I mean, I could try to cap it, but it seems weird. I, I mean, I consider I like put S8 here and I could place stones to stop it from going too far, but I don't know if that's the best way to do it. <laughs> oh, you guys are common. I've been thinking like this whole last five minutes, is this group dead? And um, said comments in the channel are suggesting that, you know, it might be dead. <laughs> Might not have to worry too much about that thing. <laughs> oh, goodness. But I have no idea. Um, okay, so this is why you can't completely ignore first line extensions. It's because they can become second line extensions. And um, I only let it go that far because I don't know what I'm doing. That's why. 
If it is dead, I do have to kill it. I mean, he's investing an awful lot of stones extending that for some reason. I'm just going to guess this. This is probably incorrect, but I'm guessing at this point. Didn't I kill that thing? <sighs> Reading is hard. That's Atari. Right, I forgot about that. It's another Atari. Oh my, well no, that is, I'm Atariing him now. Um. I'm stopping that from connecting to his other stuff. Oh. I'm an idiot. Okay. Why did I think this was dead? Because I'm bad. That's why. Ten. Your opponent passed. Um... I assume if I pass, that's game. Uh, don't pass. We're going to try playing a few more moves and see what happens. Oh, white to move. So apparently I passed. Whether I wanted to or not. Um...
Oh, right, I could have... Well, whatever. Um... not necessary but I'm losing my mind here which is why I wanted to pass and score the game but uh, what's sanity compu compared to a few points <laughs> um, This is optimistic. Uh, this is like way too optimistic on my part. I'm losing my mind here, so what do I do? Can I even cut? Ten, nine, eight, seven. Also, my mouse doesn't always click, so I might just lose on time. Nothing's left. I don't understand the whole point of not passing then. Like, there could have been something, but there isn't. We're just filling in Dami at this point, as far as I know. Minus my ridiculous excursion in the corner there. Um... Ten. I don't even know if I had to do that or not. Probably not, but with... 10 seconds remaining, it seemed like an okay move. It might have lost me a territory. So I'm just being dumb at this point. Like, he filled in his own territory, so... We're both being double-digit cues at this point, and I'm losing my mind trying to find something. terrible things I missed. Oh my goodness. Okay, variation. Man, this kills the... Oh. Okay. Sure. Um, interesting geometry there. Move 267. Yeah, that just kills everything, you know. Um... Um, um, oh, that's crazy. Wow. Okay. Yeah, it's simple once you just see, like, white has one eye. Um, that's pretty profound, though. Oh, my goodness. Oh. 
I still miss being able to play on the ancient Go interface. Yeah. Yeah, it's a it's a simple three space life or death problem where white has false eyes everywhere. Um Yeah. So simple. <laughs> they should make a book that has these simple problems in it. Just give it to a beginner. A beginner's like, I have no idea what you're talking about. And you're like, oh, it's simple. Just put it right there. And you're like, oh, okay, right. Uh, but yeah, this is why you do those life and death problems. Also, I'm curious. Just okay, How do I go back to the game? Or back to other stuff. Variation, mess for white. One, so I play there. Two, three, four, five. Okay. So I could have caused some havoc here. I didn't want to see the stone at two. Um, but if he plays two and I play three, he's forced to play four. I have time for five. Then he's got time for like six or something, and I mean, I've created some havoc, I guess. Um, I don't know what happens next. But I've got two stones on the other side of this, so that's cool. Um, that's why he couldn't play G16 whenever he actually played that. Oh, he played it right here. Okay, so yeah, that's... Wow. Okay, cool. Another variation I missed. One, two, three, four... Okay. Um... Two is interesting in this variation. So, oh, one, that's Atari, so that's why two is played. And then three, I have two liberties here, but this is Atari again. So Atari, Atari, Atari. Um, yeah, that would have been really strong and super forcing. Use the tree for navigating moves. Is that not what I'm doing? Um, like I'm getting lost. I know there used to be a way you would just like while reviewing a game. Uh, where's the? There's like a review this game button, but I'm not sure if that'll get rid of all the variations that we were talking about. Like, uh, oh, okay, cool. Play F19 now. You must have been in that other variation that F19 now made sense. Or maybe it's here. I don't know. <laughs> probably not. Um, probably in that other, like, mess for white variation, this. Oh, this thing, where I was saying, like, if white plays here, play F19. Oh, well, that seems okay. <laughs> Uh, oh. Oh, that's kind of a problem. Wow. Yeah, F19 there is kind of a threat. Um, okay. Oh. Ah, right. Yeah, that, that seems like kind of a threat. That could be an issue. Uh jeez. Um what else did I miss? Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to follow most of this. In part because I'm like super, super tired. Um like normally I would be up for looking at this stuff. Um well, let's see. Should I do one more game? 
Or should we spend a little more time reviewing this, despite me just struggling to follow? Even these basic things. Show full. Pr oh. Sure. <laughs> I really do need sleep. Um, do I want to see? Sure. Like, what gets me is these things, where I see, like, these eyes are right next to each other, kind of, sort of, but this is actually uh, white living. This sort of thing gets me all the time. And I keep reasoning, oh, I'll just take out one half of this, and then I'll take out the other half. <laughs> uh, review. Oh. Okay, cool. Reviews. Let's view the review. Huh. They're adding in voice chat. That's kind of cool. Uh, okay. If you have two stones in the corner of an eye, it is a false eye. If you have two stones... Oh! It's that simple. Interesting. Yeah, I was going to ask about what is there any other situation. Yes, yeah, so that's the other situation. Wow. Well, now I feel stupid. Just kidding, but... Oh my goodness. This changes everything! I don't know. This is special. Uh, on the edge of the board, you just need one. You just need some influence near the eye for it to... Okay. Ah, right. That's cool. That's what's been confusing me a lot. Um, all right, in this variation. Uh, it's no longer a false eye. Yeah, yeah, that's a pretty special situation, but you're right. Um, if both black groups are alive, um, or if both black groups have an eye of their own, um, then this shared false eye is an eye. Yeah. Yeah, it's the same as if uh, Black actually had a stone there, um, and he still has the two eyes, but it also counts as a point of territory. <laughs> Another Dan player on OGS. Well, that's exciting. Hate to let you down, uh, Scott Maker, we'll say. Um, hate to let you down, not actually a Don player. I know the, the stream title might have, like, hidden the fact that um, I'm like a 20 Q, but, you know, my name's got D-A-N in it, so that should be worth a title. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, for life and death, that's worth knowing that um, 
if you have two groups and each group ha each individually has an eye and they share a false eye that that's not really a false eye anymore that's cool yeah um so Yeah, pardon me. I've been up since forever um, ago. So uh, maybe we'll come back later this week and play some more Go. I just couldn't miss out on the opportunity for that fantastic stream title. So, you know, we had some fun. Killed some stones. I don't even know if I ranked up today or not, but we're doing okay. We're hanging in there. So, yeah, that will be useful. And hopefully, you know, if I forget it next time, feel free to remind me. But, like, having two stones on the corners, that seems like a pretty strong indicator. Um, obviously, if you have just, like, one stone leading right into it, on an edge, that's not an eye either, but <laughs> yeah, I'm a Don in music, I would say so. I don't play professionally, um, but anyway, hope this has been fun. Maybe we've learned a thing or two. Maybe, we'll see. Probably I'm the only one learning from these streams, if I had to guess, but at least we're having fun. So, uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time.